We're back with another $20 challenge, Aldi versus Coles. We're going to buy the same item and see how much it costs at each store. First up, let's get some avocados. This is a pack of five. Then I picked up some ground coffee. It's 250 grams and we're going to keep the weight the same across both stores. Next up, I got some honey. And then I found myself lost in the Aldi special buys because you just never know what you're going to get there. But this will not help our $20 challenge, so we move on. I think cheese is always a good barometer of how expensive things are. So I picked up a block of cheese as well. I picked up some biscuits and I was tempted to get the Jats value pack but the beauty of Aldi is that they do have their brands which are super similar to the OG actual versions so I got some Eaton's aka Aldi Jats. Those five items came to $19.81 under our $20 so with that in our bag let's hit up Coles. Their pack of avocados said they're on special for $5 but not sure what they are on special from or if they're just perpetually on special aka always five dollars and for all the stuff like the honey and the coffee we're going to get the coles brand to keep things as cheap as possible everyone in the last video who said they hate coles radio i'm sorry but it was once again popping off today then i picked up some cheese and made sure that it was the exact same weight as the aldi one and then i beelined for the jats which also just happened to be on sale and scanned all our goodies to go home it's time to put aldi and coles to the test all up our five items came Came in at $19.90. It would have been slightly cheaper if you use cash because there is a card surcharge. But it's still five items for under $20. Now for the exact same items at Coles came in at $24. There's a dollar savings from the Jats in there. So if the Jats weren't on sale, it would be $25. There's about $5 difference, which over a whole shop would be big.